Look around Lewis Breland's Garden City home and you'll see family pictures and a few reminders of his five years of service in the Navy. But you won't find Christian crosses, stars of David or other religious symbols. Breland is an atheist and he says that can create problems living in the Bible Belt. You become something of, uh, something of, of a stereotype immediately. You know, they think you're angry, they think you're, you know, or a Satan worshiper or something absolutely peculiar. Though Breland won't be attending the Reason Rally this weekend in Washington, he thinks events like that, plus best-selling books and documentaries about atheism, are signs that things are changing. You know, the popular culture, people are having access to these ideas, and they're increasingly becoming fed up and not convinced with the supernatural and metaphysical claims of religion. When it comes to the Reason Rally, Jerry Alley of Sockesty will settle for watching news coverage of it. She doesn't like the crowds. But she does like the message of tolerance and a focus that's more about what she does believe than on what she doesn't. Just saying that you believe in love and human beings and making and kindness, that's pretty much what it is. It's not what we don't believe in, it's what, you know what I don't believe in? Hate. Allie says she used to be very religious but went through a spiritual journey that led her to non-belief. She says she doesn't seek out debate about religion or concentrate on the challenge of living in a highly religious community. When someone says, bless you or I'll pray for you, I don't take offense. I was like, that's sweet. It's like me saying, you know, I'm going to think positive healing thoughts about you 